Hi, my name is Phil. Uh, I'm a founder at Doxy, and I'm going to show you how to use Doxy. Uh, Doxy is used for one page sites. So, for example, if you need to create your product documentation or your terms of service, uh, you would use Doxy, you would create uh, your document there, and you would embed it into your site with a string of JavaScript. So, you don't need to have some strange subdomain or some other host host your stuff for you, it all can be on your site. That's the point and the power of Doxy. So let me demonstrate to you how to quickly get started with Doxy, how to create a sample document and how to embed it on GitHub pages. So let's get started. But, uh, to start, we are going to click add on the top right of the screen and we're going to add a shelf. A shelf is just like a site, right? So we're going to call it uh, my cool docs and uh, the description is going to be my cool docs. Why not? And we're going to add the shelf. Uh, by default, when the shelf is created, you have a book. A book is something like a web page, uh, a single page. So I'm going to call this page documentation. Now let's get started. So in order to create your documentation, you need to have multiple uh, sections of your documentation, which are broken down into articles over here. And uh, you need to have content, right? So let's do some quick content. We're going to do getting started. All right, so uh, to get started, how about we uh, provide our customers with some context, our application prints uh, hello world to a stranger online. And uh, let's say we want to provide them with a getting started video of it printing the hello world, right? Uh, so we just embedded the video right here. And then in order to activate our application, Uh, go to helloworldgo.com uh, We can quickly link it up like this Go to hello and click uh, spin hello world uh, Whatever it may be right and then maybe we want to show excitement So we want to add some uh, image from Unsplash. Uh, let's say excitement Uh, yeah, perfect. Well, uh, very exciting. Now, let's say that this was our getting started page, and now we're gonna add one more article that's gonna basically say a uh, quick how to, right? So, let's say uh, how to upload an image in our application. So, let's say I wanna upload some pictures uh, to show people how it's done. So step one, open image gallery. Okay, I just want to bold it and put it like this, format it correctly. And uh, essentially just uh, drag and drop and upload an image, right? So, right. So I'm just going to click publish. And I'm going to select the default Doxy style. I'm going to pick life. And to see that it looks okay, I'm going to click the development preview. Uh, it seems to look just fine. So it looks like uh, everything uh, worked out nicely. This is a, it's a nice page with some uh, dynamic uh, content. And uh, I'm going to take this, right? And I'm going to go over to GitHub, right? And in GitHub, I'm going to create a new repository. Uh, I'll call it another Doxy demo. Uh, another demo of doxy.io, right? And uh, yeah, I'll initialize it with a readme just to uh, so I don't have to deal with anything else and uh, pulling anything on Git itself. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna create a file called index.html, and I'm just gonna put the JavaScript in here. That's all. There is nothing else to do. Uh, and uh, I'm gonna click uh, creating another doxy demo and I'm gonna commit this message okay and now I'm going to click settings and I'm gonna scroll down and I'm gonna go to the section called github pages right this is the section I'm gonna click source I'm gonna click the master branch and I'm gonna click save that's it I'm done so at this point doxy has actually been published on the github pages 
and all the content we created are now hosted for free uh, on github pages and I have a pretty cool looking uh, single page uh, static uh, site so hopefully this has been helpful for you there are a lot more powerful features of doxy uh, that are available and I will cover them in other tutorials uh, thank you very much for watching and have an awesome day